Greetings, one and all. As those of you who have followed my channel for a while will already know, I like to collect hockey cards. I'm not the ultimate collector who has to own every single card known to man, but I do enjoy collecting hockey cards casually as a hobby and owning a piece of hockey history, however big or small that piece is. I mainly collect NHL cards as they are the most widely available, especially in a country like the UK where ice hockey isn't exactly the biggest commodity out there, but I have wanted to add some cards from Britain's Elite Ice Hockey League to my collection as they are my homeland league, they are my native league, they are the one that I've started to look at more as ice hockey has started to grow in this country more, and I'd really like to have some cards to replicate that in my collection. Specifically, I'd like to add some Nottingham Panthers cards to my collection, as they are my favourite EIHL team. I had to keep wishing for such a gift to be bestowed upon me. Hockey cards from the Elite Ice Hockey League? Odd Man Rush, are you mad? That's what they'd all tell me. Until last week, when... BOOM! My prayers were answered and finally heard. Yes, Ice Locker have released some Nottingham Panthers hockey card packs. Each pack holds, I think, six cards, and there are 22 cards in the set to collect, with the chance of a shiny or autograph parallel in the card packs also. The 22 card collection is made up of famous faces or fan favourites over the last few seasons for the Nottingham Panthers, including the likes of David Clark, Cam Jansen, and Brian McGrattan. Now, I bought five of these packs. Let me just show you all them here. Five different packs. I bought five packs of cards, so hopefully we will be able to complete this set and have all of the different cards, and we'll probably have some spares. I don't really know what I'm going to do with them. I might be able to give them away. I might just leave them. Who knows? Life's a mystery, folks. So anyway, let's open these bad boys up and see what we get, shall we? So let's open this first pack here. How do we open this? It's got a little tab on the front. That's nice. Oh, it's opening. Oh, this is exciting. Right, so we have... Let's have a look. We start with... Oh my god, how would you say that name? Juraj Kolnik. Juraj Kolnik? Juraj Kolnic? That's the first one. We have Ollie Betteridge. Yes, the man himself, Ollie Betteridge. We have Cam Jansen. Nice, we get one of the ones I mentioned earlier. We get Shane Mal Madalora. Madalora? Madalora. Shane Madalora. We get Dan Spang, the Spanger. There's a Spanger in the works, folks. And we get Stevie Lee, the current captain of the Nottingham Panthers here. So let me just run through each of these again, just in case you couldn't see him. So we got Dan Spang. We got Shane Madalora. We got Cam Jansen. We got Ollie Betteridge. And we got Juraj Kolnik, or Kolnic. Now, it, what's really nice about these is each of them have their position. They have their... Uh, team, obviously, which is all the Nottingham Panthers. I don't know why they put that on there. They have their jersey number and the season in which they played for the team. And on the back, they have their their picture and how they did the season before they came to the Panthers and the season after and the height, weight and shot and position. I really like these cards, actually. They're, they're very professional. They're very good. Like Steve Lee, for example, played two seasons with the Panthers. I think it's going off their... Well, it depends what season they played for the Panthers, obviously. Like, the 16-17 stats with the uh, Panthers. Played for the Hamburg Freezers the season before. Nice, not too bad. And then you've got Dan Spang there. So he, this is the 16-17 season. Do we have any 17-18 season? Nope, but we have Cam Jansen. He played for the Albany Devils before, and he got two points in 34 games. Nice one, Cam Jansen. <laughs> Wait, let's just focus this. Let's focus this one in. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> so yeah, we get we get some pretty decent cards here. I'm quite happy with them. No no special cards yet, but they are the first ones, the first ones that we've got so far. So let's just bring in the next pack. We've got the second pack of cards. Second pack of five. Hopefully we don't get too many repeats. I've got to get myself a signed David Clark. So we start with Michael Garnett, the goaltender for this season. Then we get we get another Juraj Kolnic. Brilliant. We get another Oli Betteridge. Oh, we get David Ling. This is a special one. This was like a limited edition one. David Ling. What's this little... Is this like the alternate logo of the Nottingham Panthers or something? Oh, that's a very nice card. We get... Uh, what the hell is that name? Yindrick, but his name's Henry. Paisel. I've probably said that awfully. We get Robert Farmer. And that's it. So we get... I think this must be a limited edition one. Or, or this must be a special one. Because it's got, it's got a different jersey on. Interesting. David Ling. Wow, he had 42 points in 32 games for the Nottingham Panthers. That's not too shabby. So we get Garnet, who's had his season this year. 
Michael Garnett. Nice. They don't actually have like a proper, oh, this is just me. Oh, here's a, he played for uh, Slovan uh, Bratislava, which was a KHL team, I believe. Nice, not too bad. And played for um, Medvesak Zagreb. I probably said that right. I'm not sure. So I'm going to separate the um, the uh, duplicates that I already have. They can go over there. So Garnet, Ling, Pacel, and Farmer join the pile. Now we're down to the final three, folks. Let's see what else we get. Give me something good. I want a signed David Clark card. Signed David Clark card. Let's get these out, please. Come on. Out you come. Oh, here we go. We start with the head coach, or soon to be the ex-head coach, Corey Nielsen. So we start with Corey Nielsen. We get Mika Weichmann, led the team to a Continental Cup last season. Good job, son. We get Matthew Gagnon, the big bruiser himself. We get Juraj Kolnic again. We get Jeff Dimon. I haven't heard of him before. Fair play. And we get Dan Spang again. Nice. So we, we had a few more duplicates. Let's just get them out of the uh, get them out of the picture. So Kolnic again and Dan Spang. Goodbye. So Corey Nielsen. Let's have a look at this one. Oh, look at him. He's so happy. I'm leaving my job soon. Poor guy. So his uh, season stats with the Panthers. Because he played. Yes, he did actually play for the Panthers. He had 47 points in 2010-11. slash Wow, fair play. Well, nine goals and seven, uh, 47 assists. Bloody hell. He was a guy that liked to pass the puck and not shoot it by the looks of it. Weichmann, who's now playing for the uh, Milton Keynes Lightning. We've got the bruiser Matthew Gagnon. What's it saying so far? So it doesn't have this season stats, but this is the season he's played for us. Had three points last season. Uh, well, three points in 2015-16. And then uh, 15 points with the Brampton Beast. Nice, not too bad. Jeff Dimon, who played his season in 16-17. And Corey, that's quite a nice card of Corey Nielsen, though. I'll, I'll give him credit. Corey Nielsen, fair play. I mean, it sucks to see him go, but it's kind of what has to happen. So, the penultimate pack of cards, ladies and gents. Are we going to get any more duplicates? Are we going to get Kulnich again? Bloody hope not. We start with Eric Lindhagen. Yes, good man. Lindhagen. We get Corey Nielsen again. If anybody wants a Nielsen card, you're more than welcome. Jeff Dimon again. We get Zach Phillips, the man. Oh, and we get another David Ling. So the David Ling card seems to be different from the rest of them. Oh, Zach Phillips. Now that is a face of focus right there, ladies and gentlemen. If I could actually focus. Go on, fo focus in. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Focus in on Zach Phillips, please. No, you don't want to focus it. It doesn't want to focus in on Zach Phillips. Fair play. Fair play. Can you focus in here on Zach Phillips? There you go. I will kill you. Right, so uh, David Ling is a repeat. Stevie Lee's a repeat. I'm glad we got Lindhagen, though. Uh, Jeff Dimon. Yep, so these two guys are repeats. So we only got two out of the six cards there weren't repeats. So those ones go away. We have Eric Lindhagen and Zach Phillips. So let's just count how many cards we've got at the moment. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So I think every single card in this next pack would have to be a non-repeat for us to have all the cards in the set. Might have to ask about and be like, does anybody have the last cards? Because I don't have them. So, the last pack, we start with Corey Nielsen. Three straight Nielsens, brilliant. Then we get Dan Spang. Well, we've already got him. Oh, there you go. The big man himself, Brian McGrattoon. Good, I'm glad that we got him. We get Vikeman again. We get Michael Garnett again. And we get Logan McMillan. Okay, so we got a few, few new ones, which is nice. I approve. Awesome. So let's just take out the, the new ones that we've got. Uh, Brian McGratton and Logan McMillan. Join the collection, lads. And then we have Corey, we have Dan, we have Mika, and we have Michael Garnett. So, how many duplicates did we get? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 out of the 30 cards we got were duplicates, I think. We're six times... Yeah, 30 cards, I think. And then uh, normal ones. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So we managed to pick up 18 out of the 22 cards. Logan McMillan. That's a shame, though. We were so close to getting every single one of the cards. I really wanted a David Clark. And I didn't get a David Clark. But I got a Brian McGratton and three Corey Nielsen. So I can't really complain, can I, folks? And there you go. That was a look at the Nottingham Panthers trading cards from the Elite Ice Hockey League. What do you guys think about this set of cards? Are they good? Bad? Or do you wish that your favourite team had done a set of trading cards? Maybe the Steelers? Maybe the Cardiff Devils? Maybe the Belfast Giants? You should start hounding them on Twitter. Maybe they'll start doing them. But thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed. Please feel free to like, subscribe, share, or watch some of my other videos. 
Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye. Subscribe or I kill you!